What was there a reluctance to on his part to fight uh, left-handed fighters? Do you remember much about that? Oh uh, yeah, I think he addressed that a little bit to the father. He always told me, "No southpaws, no southpaws." It's true. I mean, you you see his style; it's really fit to fight a right-handed fighter. Now he's fought some lefties. He, uh, Zab Judah for one, uh, and uh, Ta uh, Chop Chop Corley for another. Those guys gave him problems. He rose above the problems, they gave him problems. But Judah and Corley are not Manny Pacquiao. Remember that. Corner. He's wearing the black trunks with white trim and weighed in at 132 and one half pounds. Hailing from Fort Wayne, Indiana, he has a professional record of one win with one loss. Of the he has one win with no losses. That win coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Pretty Boy Floyd Mayweather. Yo, Diaz humming raw high to yeah, Mayweather. I, I noticed that. There's the numbers. Mayweather with a very slight edge. Miguel, a man of many talents, he's rule him, rule him, rule. I don't know what that was all about, but it was a nice tune. And this will give us an indication of how well Mayweather did in round two. Landing right at that 49%, which is exactly what he landed in his first pro fight overall. Nice to see Bob Canobio and Logan Hobson from. <laughs> the total punch is indicating Mayweather with the lead, but not a huge lead. Landing in the 40% area and throwing just about the same number of punches as Sandy. And we take a look at the punches throughout the fight, and you see Mayweather very efficient. Although Sanders threw seven more, it was Mayweather who landed 23 more punches and a higher percentage. For our ring announcer, here's Thomas Traber. All right, and there's a look at the opponent, Bobby Giefert. Second fight in 29 months. 19 wins, 8 losses, and for Mo Mayweather, and his record so far is 5-0 and oh with 4 KOs. This one's scheduled for oh. 6. Down goes Giefert. Quick, Three, straight, four, right hand punch. Five, Seems to six, be aware of what's going on. Seven, Does he want to get up? Yeah, he wants to get up. Right. But he shouldn't last much longer now. Giefert now fiddling with the nose as he tries to get the blood flow to stop. And Mayweather comes back with rights and Giefert will go down and That's it. Joe Cortez says that'll do. One minute, 28 seconds sorry, sorry, of the sorry. first round, or about a minute and a half of the first round, something like that. And Floyd Mayweather has yet another quick on, KO sorry. victory. Bounds. His professional record, 28 victories, including 16 knockouts with only two to and a draw. Professional record, a perfect one. 31 bouts. 31 victories, including 21 knockouts. The jab over the shoulder of Mayweather has been very effective at this stage. But Mayweather has also managed to land a straight right a couple times and stuns Corley with a straight right right under the jaw. Interestingly, in round one, Mayweather launched 27 power punches by CompuBox count, but Corley threw 28 back. However, Mayweather landing at a higher frequency rate and landed a good-sized left hook there. You keep punching that. that. You keep touching that. You're doing what you're doing. That's what makes it work easy. Mayweather with excellent power punching numbers via CompuBox in the first two rounds. There is landing 44%. There is a bit of a welt under the right eye of Mayweather. Brother would be running back and he would be aggressive. If he rolls up, they reversed. Here's a big left hand by Corley. Momentarily stuns Mayweather. Hurt Mayweather too. Mayweather grins, fires back two body shots. You had him hurt, Tommy. You let him get away. Get up on him. Make him fight. He don't want to fight. 
We want to sit outside and pick shots. Make them fight, man. Fight them up. Count your box numbers through the third round. Mayweather 55 out of 152. Corley 31 out of 160. Harold Letterman, how do you have it through? <laughs> okay, Jim. Three to nothing. 30 to 27. Floyd Mayweather. Well, he's in trouble now as Demarcus Corley once again catches him and now tries to go to work against the ropes. A right hand sent Mayweather back into the ropes. And now Corley working against a Mayweather who's leaning back against the ropes. Trying to get in something good to the body as Mayweather tries to fend him off while leaning back. And I, I, one thing I'll give Corley credit for, he's trying to take his time, not throwing up too many punches where he drains himself, trying to wait for a good clean punch. Corley not over anxious, Mayweather gathering himself and coming back. Now he tries to stop Corley's offense with body shots of his own. Mayweather's hurt, but he's still fighting back. Great left hook by Mayweather. Now Corley's hurt. There's an opportunity for Corley here if he can take it, because as you, we just said, he is hurt. I think both fighters are hurt here. Yeah, there's an opportunity for Mayweather too. And we're only about halfway through the round. Trading shots at close range. Suddenly it's Daddy Ward 4 in a... In a pairing where we never expected to see it. But Mayweather's very good with those little short punches in close like this here. Whereas Carly has to get a little bit more swing room for him. Right hand by Mayweather. Mayweather. Hardest punch of the fight. Corley visibly stunned by that one. Trying to duck and slip. Catches another big right hand. And down goes Corley to his knee. Two mm -hmm. solid right hand shots by Floyd Mayweather. He's a little bit not in that. But you know, the way it's going, I don't think it's going to go to 12 rounds. Hard and right hands by Corley. Two in a row. Mayweather took him very well. Going back with his own shots. Big drama in Atlantic City. Floyd Mayweather trying to supplant Roy Jones atop the pound for pound list. And playing a game of Russian roulette with Demarcus Corley. He already hurt. Yeah. Go on. Listen. The last round. Indeed, he ran to his corner after all that and seemed anxious to get back in there. Whereas Corley looked a little weary in his corner between rounds four and five. What him, champ? He been champ before. Time for him to change over, champ. Right. Come on, man. Let's go. When you get inside, let your remember. Hard. Uh, Mayweather, 23 out of 56 by CompuBox count in round five. And as you can see, he has so far won every round on Harold Letterman's scorecard. Hands also. Well, you know, Oscar's been in a lot of super fights, and he's got extremely fast hands. And he knows how to win those decisions. And a great deal of savvy. And a lot of guts to what he has to. CompuBox numbers in the sixth. Mayweather, 23 out of 51. Corley, 10 out of 59. And uh, Harold, how do you have it through six? Okay, Jim, 60 to 54, six rounds to nothing, Floyd Mayweather Jr. You beat me, you beat me, but still, put your shots together. You ain't got a towel? Go ahead. On seven, Gompy Box found only nine punches landed for DeMarcus Corley. That's his lowest number so far in the fight. Still, he could change everything with one big punch. Well, the thing about Mayweather is he's the kind of fighter who... And continuing to work underneath to the body of Corley. Corley lands two shots, but takes two bigger ones in return. And this time it will be called a knockdown. As amid the pressure, Corley put his knee on the canvas. Uh, this did can work. Round there. Get rid of it quick. The CompuBox numbers, 33 out of 54, 61%. Brutal. Corley 13 out of 53. Mayweather continues winning every single round on Harold Letterman's scorecard. Weapons in his arsenal. And again, to repeat the point that Emmanuel has made several times, such remarkable accuracy on his punches. Left took Flores Corley right in the center of the ring. Everything was short. He just locked his arms up and twisted the punches off. Never had to reach and throw anything wide. Perfect crap. Will come. Harold, how do you have it through 10? Okay, Jim. 10 rounds, 
to nothing, 100 to 88. Floyd Mayweather Jr. Flip there. Hey, hey Floyd, open your mouth for a second. It's nothing serious. Open your mouth. Don't stop punching. Out their assignments in this fight. Corey, Artem, that he so desperately wants. What he wants is to be the... The copy box numbers I was talking about as Mayweather, dominant throughout, landed an average of better, 20, better than 20 punches per round. Power shot category will also be dominated by Mayweather, largely on the basis of the straight right hand, which he landed constantly throughout the fight, ultimately landing twice as many power shots as Corley while throwing just about the same number and now let's go to Larry Merchant in the ring of our nation's capital of Washington DC by way of Tacoma Park Maryland he weighed in at a ready 145 and one quarter pounds with a record of 56 wins, four losses. He has 31 wins coming by way of knockout. He weighed in at the welterweight limit of 147 pounds even. He is undefeated in his campaign to the ring with a perfect record of 34 wins, no losses, 23 wins coming by way of knockout. Punches in round one by copy box count. Mitchell throwing 46 but landing only three. Mayweather ignoring the jab through mostly power shots, 34 punches, and landed 13 of them. But 12 of those 13 lands were power shots. Come a little bolder. I doubt it. Copy box numbers in round two. Mayweather 13 out of 43. Sean Bay Mitchell 9 out of 57. I think to defend against short punches, not wild looping punches. So the wild looping punches usually are off for him. First knockdown of the fight comes on a straight right hand. Right into the mouth of Mitchell. It's amazing because the opponent knows that Mayweather's looking to throw a straight right hand in that situation, but he's so quick with it that you can't stop it anyway. Harold, how do you have it through three? Three rounds to nothing, 30 to 26. Floyd Mayweather Jr. Don't load up, man. You gotta let your hands go and you gotta stay off the ropes, man. Just keep them turning. Our punches to round five. Mayweather 56 out of 133. Mitchell 24 out of 125. Or to impose himself on a real strong welterweight. Yes, he Second does. knockdown. This time the knockdown is on a body shot. We've seen a lot of knockouts on body shots in recent years. Mitchell's in no hurry to get up, and that's that. I think Richard Steele saw the turn. A final look at CompuBox numbers, Mayweather versus Mitchell. And Floyd Mayweather Jr. landing at about a 40% rate compared to about a 10% rate for the opponent, Mitchell. Power punching numbers, and uh, here Mayweather's connect percentage goes up, as does Mitchell's marginally. But at the end of the day, 65 to 24 in landed power punches. And Mayweather's punches by far the harder. Really, Mitchell only landed two overhand lefts that mattered in the fight. Let's go to Larry Merchant standing by with the number one pound for pound fighter in boxing, Floyd.